There is something in the in-between moments of making art that can be magnified to reveal truths about oneself. Moments where you make a stroke of watercolor and see it pool in an area you didn't intend, and you quickly try to fix it, change it, make it better. You make a judgment in that moment, and a decision to alter it. Did you notice how quickly you needed to make that adjustment? Did you feel how much discomfort that mistake caused you? Now your priorities matter here. If you're making a piece to look exactly like Albert Einstein and your pooling watercolor hinders you from that, then it makes sense that you want to change it. But do you ever make art just to explore your discomfort? Do you ever sit with that pooling watercolor and feel the anxiety rising in your chest and the slight panic of making a mistake and just let it sit there? Do you ever get curious about what would happen if you didn't try to avoid it or shut it off or judge yourself for it? Would it get worse? Would the feeling grow so intense that your body panics and sends you into cardiac arrest? Probably not, right? But would you become angry and tear up the paper you worked so hard on? Would you stop painting for the rest of the day, the week, the month, your whole life? Maybe. Who knows? Or what if that feeling slowly subsided as you sat with it? What if it swelled like a bubble to its bursting point, popped, and then receded? What would you have room for after that looming bubble was gone? What decisions would you make with that piece of art afterward? Would it be the same? Would you discover more bubbles? Would you find yourself in a different frame of mind than you've painted in before? Maybe. Who knows? I think art can be used by the creator not only as an expression of the thoughts and feelings inside their head, but also an exploration of the self, and all its tiny voices speaking in between the lines, between the thoughts, quietly so as not to be noticed. Notice them. If you don't like the art that comes out of it, there's always a trash can to throw it in, or a match to burn it with. But what if you do like it? What if there's more to you than you thought? What if you used curiosity and self-compassion to guide your art sometimes? Your life sometimes? It is a tool that can be used in so many ways. Experience yourself with it.